Hey, what's up my piano playing people and welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to teach you guys how to play the song Rainbow by Casey Musgraves. This song, I'm not going to lie to you, it's not the most easy song on the planet due to all the chord changes, but I promise I'll make it as easy as possible and we're going to get through it together. So I will make sure you guys learn how to play this song if that's your goal is to play the song. Um, enough talking and let's get into the tutorial. So, like I said, this song is a little bit tricky, it's kind of intermediate, I guess, but there are five chords in it, and the chords aren't too bad. They are F, A, B, C minor, and E. And I'm going to teach you guys how to play each chord that I just showed you, starting with F. In the left hand, it is F and C. In the right hand, it is F. A and C. Next is A. In the left hand, it is A sharp and E sharp. In the right hand, it is A sharp, C, and E sharp. Next is B. In the left hand, it is B sharp and F. In the right hand, it is B sharp, D, and F. Next is C minor. In the left hand it is C and G. In the right hand it is C, E sharp, and G. My dog is singing. I'm so sorry guys. Lastly is the chord of E. In the left hand it is E sharp and B sharp. In the right hand, it is E sharp, G, and B sharp. So those are the five chords you have to know in order to play this song. So for the beginning of the song, the introduction, the da 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 da. I'm gonna make sure that this is a very simple introduction. I'm not gonna do like, not that it's complex, but um. When you play it, you're kind of just hitting the last one right here. Okay, so this is the complex. This is not what I'm showing you guys, okay? So, for the original, she kind of plays it like... And then goes down. You do not have to do it like that. I am not going to teach you guys how to play it that way. So, for a very basic version of that introduction, it is just... E, C minor, A, then back to E, okay? And you can do that one time, two times, it really depends. If you need a, like an extra breath to just get going, then do it two times. I personally play it once because that's just who I am as a person. But you're the one playing piano, you do it however you want. Nothing has to sound like the original. So, you are going to start on that last E, okay? So the, when it rains, it pours, that is on E, okay? So, after the introduction, we're starting with the first verse. So, you start on E, and you do that same thing again. When it rains, it pours, C minor, but over to A. But you didn't even notice. E, it ain't raining C minor anymore back to E it's hard to breathe when all yeah from that E you were gonna go over to B no you know is okay so do you guys get that again a little bit quicker when it rains it pours but you didn't even notice it ain't raining anymore it's hard to breathe when all you know is. From that B, you are going to go back down to C minor. When all you know is the struggle of staying above. Up to A. And then again, you're going to drop down to B. The rising water. And then over to F. Lines. Heads up, that's the only time you're ever going to use the F chord, okay? The rising water lights before you get into the chorus. So, again, we're going to do that part again, okay? It ain't raining anymore. It's hard to breathe when all you know is, okay? 
The struggle of staying above the rising water lines. So, do you guys see that part? I feel like I'm going a little bit too quick, but like I lose my pace, especially with songs like this that I'm not like perfect on the chord order. So I kind of have to keep myself going and you guys have to keep yourself going too. You can always rewind the video of anything, but again, I'm gonna try and slow down for you. I feel like I'm getting too caught up. But yeah, so we're gonna go over the full first verse and then I'll teach you guys how to play the chorus. So again, we're gonna start from the very beginning. So introduction time, E, C minor, A, E. Ready? you are going to do the same exact playing order as we did for the introduction and for the first verse. So again, the E, C minor, A, E, okay? So from the chorus, cause the sky is finally open, the rain and wind stop blowing, you just stuck out in the same old storm again. So do you guys see that? So you go one time around, cause the sky is finally open, the rain and wind stop blowing, you just stuck out in the same old storm. And instead of going to E after that A, you were just gonna go down to B. Again, again, you hold tight to your umbrella, oh darling I'm just trying to tell ya that there's always been a rainbow hanging over and then from that B the head is on E hanging over your head do you guys see what's happening like so it's basically the same thing twice except the only thing that changes is from that B on the last part, you're gonna go up to E again, okay? So I'm gonna go over the chorus, like a flow of the chorus real quick, and then we'll do a full run through very slowly, okay? So here we go, from the chorus. Cause the sky is finally open, the rain and wind stop blowing, it just stuck out in the same old storm again. understood this tutorial I hope it wasn't too difficult but yeah so listen for you can listen to my run through of the song completely or you could leave please make sure to like and subscribe before you go though and leave a suggestion down for what you guys would like to learn so yeah thank you so much and bye everybody i
so much for watching this piano tutorial. If you have any suggestions for songs you'd like to learn, please comment them down in the comment section below and make sure to like and subscribe. Thank you so much everybody and bye!